Welcome back to our channel, dear viewers. Today, we are diving into the fascinating world of unusual tribal traditions. And trust me, you're in for a treat. In this video, we'll be exploring the Bororo tribe, a unique community known for their intriguing post-wedding ritual. Brace yourselves, because after tying the knot, the men in this tribe shave their heads. Yes, you heard that right. But why do they do it? What does it symbolize? Stick around till the end to uncover the intriguing story behind this age-old tradition. And if you enjoy this video, don't forget to subscribe to our channel, give it a thumbs up, and share your thoughts in the comments section below. Let's get started. The Bororo tribe, a fascinating community nestled deep within the heart of Brazil, boasts a rich tapestry of unique and intriguing traditions. Amongst the various customs that define their way of life, one particular tradition stands out as exceptionally distinctive, the act of men shaving their heads after weddings. This ritual holds profound significance within Bororo culture and serves as a symbolic gesture that transcends mere aesthetics. The Bororo tribe, known for their intricate body paintings, vibrant clothing, and elaborate adornments, places great importance on the institution of marriage. Weddings are celebrated with much pomp and grandeur, marking the union of two individuals and the merging of two families. However, it is the post-wedding ritual of head shaving that truly captures the attention and curiosity of outsiders. The act of shaving one's head is seen as a rite of passage for Bororo men, symbolizing their transition into the realm of adulthood and assuming the responsibilities that accompany it. It signifies a shift in their social status and serves as a visual declaration of their commitment to their newly wedded spouse. By shedding their hair, Bororo men metaphorically shed their old selves, leaving behind their bachelorhood and embracing their role as husbands and future fathers. The process of head shaving in the Bororo tribe is not a simple affair. It involves a series of meticulous steps, each carrying its own significance. This tradition is typically carried out by an elder member of the tribe, often a respected community leader or a close relative of the groom. The ceremony takes place in a central gathering area, where family members, friends, and fellow tribespeople come together to witness and partake in the event. Before the actual shaving takes place, the groom is required to undergo a series of rituals, including purifying baths and symbolic blessings. These rituals are conducted to cleanse the groom's spirit, ensuring that he enters this new phase of life with purity and good fortune. Once these preliminary customs are complete, the main event begins. The Bororo tribe possesses a profound belief in the power of symbolism, and this is evident even in the act of shaving. It is not a mere act of removing hair, it is a sacred act that carries deep cultural significance. As the groom sits before the gathered crowd, the elder expertly wields a sharp blade, cautiously shaving away each strand with precision and care. This act symbolizes the shedding of the groom's former self, representing a fresh start and a commitment to his marital duties. As the hair falls to the ground, the atmosphere is filled with a mix of emotions. The groom's family members and friends offer words of encouragement and support, while the bride watches on, her eyes filled with a mixture of pride, joy, and anticipation. It is a moment of immense vulnerability for the groom, as he bears himself before his loved ones and the community, ready to embark on his new role as a devoted husband. Once the shaving is complete, the groom is cleansed once again, this time with water infused with sacred herbs and flowers. This final purification ritual represents a symbolic washing away of any lingering traces of his past life, ensuring that he enters his married life with a clean slate. In the days and weeks following the ceremony, the groom's newly chosen bald look serves as a visible reminder of his commitment and responsibilities. The shaved head becomes a powerful symbol of his marital status, serving as a constant reminder of the promises he made on his wedding day. It is not uncommon for Bororo men to keep their heads shaved for an extended period after the wedding, only allowing their hair to grow back once they have fully settled into their married life. The tradition of men shaving their heads after weddings in the Bororo tribe is a captivating custom that showcases the tribe's deep-rooted respect for tradition, symbolism, and the institution of marriage. It serves as a powerful reminder of the transformative power of love and commitment, as well as a testament to the Bororo tribe's rich cultural heritage. Through this unique tradition, the Bororo people continue to preserve their customs and pass them down to future generations, ensuring that their tribal traditions remain alive and vibrant.